So corporate profits have never been as high as today. So multinational corporations are extremely uh, profitable, their profitability is rising, and yet at the same time they pay less and less in taxes. So the effective corporate income tax rate has declined a lot over the last uh, several decades. What's the reason for that? The reason is because multinational companies shift a large and growing fraction of their profits to low or zero tax countries. So today there's the equivalent of 40% of all multinational corporate profits that are booked in low or zero tax places like Bermuda, Ireland, the Cayman Islands, or tax havens like that. So that's $600 billion in profits every year, profits that are made in, in the US, in Europe, in developing, in developing countries, but that end up being reported and taxed at very low rates in tax havens uh, globally. Uh, so that's a, that's a big problem, and the question is, what, what can we do about it? Is there, is there a solution? Um, I, I think there is a, a solution. So ideally, in the long run, what we would like to do is to have a global agreement, uh, to have countries agree on uh, having the same corporate tax rate, and at least on having a relatively high minimum corporate income tax rate. Um, that might take some time. If we want to make progress in the short run, uh, what any country can do is it can say, now I'm going to change the way that I compute the profits that are taxable in my country. So a country like the United States, for instance, could say, well, if Apple makes 50% of its profits in the US, then we're going to consider that 50% of Apple's global profits have been made in the US, and that's what will be taxed in the US. And you immediately see the beauty of that. You know, Apple can move its profits today to, to Bermuda or to Jersey, but it cannot move its customers to Bermuda or to Jersey. Customers are in the US. And so with such a reform, you can put an end immediately to, to corporate tax avoidance and, and profit shifting, and, and you can eventually you know, increase corporate income tax rates and uh, uh, corporate income tax revenue. So the good news, you know, the bad news is that there's a big problem. The good news is that there is a solution for the long run and even uh, in the short run.